Welcome to Toy Tap, where we take a look at shit in my room and we see if it's any good. Today, we're going to be looking at the Lego Sand Crawler. £250 of my money well spent. Before we uh, take a look at the actual crawler, we are going to look at all the minifigures. So, as you can see, this set came with a lot of minifigures. We've got six droids and seven little guys here. Um, although, technically, I'll count it as four. I don't think you get away with putting uh, four of the exact same character in a set and claiming that each one's a different minifigure. Bit uh, cheeky. Wally. Um, he doesn't do anything. Got butterfingers, I think. You got R2D2 and his two retarded brothers, R2 3 2 and R2 4 2. A traffic cone in green. And my favourite, Donk. The Donk droid just walks around like this. Donk. Donk. And that's it. He's a wheelie bin with legs, basically. Then we come to the actual minifigures. Um, you see, we've got, well, I guess technically he's a droid as well. I fucked that up, didn't I? It's the gay one, C-3PO. Now we come to the real minifigures. We've got Luke and Owen, I think. Something like that. I haven't seen Star Wars in a long time. So they're obviously buying the droid from these four dwarfs. Um, the dwarfs are there like, you know, I think all they say is, oh daddy. And uh, these guys have to try and communicate with that. So I'm sure that's uh, an interesting conversation. They have a uh, hair. And legs, obviously being Lego, all the bits come off. Um, so you can recreate that part from episode four, where Luke comes back and goes, Oh no, Owen, they've decapitated you. Which of course is that famous scene. Quite good at flying. in a minute. I'll obviously show you the whole minifigure. I'll put him on the spinner so you can you can get a good look around. Let's play a game I like to call Will He Stand or Will He Fall? He fell. I've lost a dwarf. Here's the sand crawler. It's um heavy basically just a big brown box made out of Lego. If you can see here, the uh, sides fold up to reveal the uh, bits inside. There you go, look, so you can still see me. You can see my eyes. You've got the front that you like crank down, like a little bit of the top here. If you look at it, you might be able to see it. That little wheel looking bit at the top. You crank that. And there you go. Look at that. That comes down and there's a little speeder in there that hey, the midgets sit on. There you go. That. Obviously they go out on their little their little family journeys on their little speeder. Then they get off and they steal a steal a droid, shooting him with their little zappy guns. We've got a nice crane as well that comes out the front. I believe that's where the uh, where the little droids hook on. We'll put R two R three D four two seven five, whatever I called him. 
he like hooks on there in some way. I think there were some things that came with it which were like other types of hooks, but they're in there somewhere and I can't be asked to go rummaging around for them. If you look from that angle, it can fly. Oh, there you go. There's a little bit more uh, interesting stuff for you. There's a crank at the back here, which uh, moves the wheels back and forth. Isn't that exciting? Not really. Uh, top comes off because it's just sat on there and reveals another crane inside. It comes with these little boxes, which you look at that, there's like a little flap here and you, you slide it in to the flap. And it just pops in like that. A little bit of play functionality for those kiddies who uh, wanna play with their brand new expensive Lego toy. put the little go-kart back in because I'm an idiot. Crank it. it. Crank it. it. says on the box, don't give to three-year-olds because they might eat the pieces. Pretty tasty if you ask me. Would recommend um, the most expensive plastic diet of my life. Owen, what happened to your hand? They're there, like egging them on. Like, yeah, woo! Do it! Do it! Yeah! Woo! Like that scene from that movie with Jerry Foster. Woo! So, that's the uh, sand crawler and all of its glory and all of its minifigures, except for that one um, little Jawa or whatever it's called that I have lost somewhere. Don't know where that's gone. Flying off into space, did the uh, little Jawa. It's a nice little set if you want to spend significant money on something. Here's what you can uh, go for. So, come back next time where we review something else. Also, to the person in the comments that mentioned about the, uh, the Batiste dry shampoo, what do you think I am? Some kind of faggot? Oh yeah. Some nice shampoo.